Yo, what's up, guys? Yeah, this one here. Back with another video. Um, I was planning on doing like one in my Naruto anime if you wanted in one day, but instead I decided to do something different. I am doing a Hunter Hunter one day, cause not many people do it. This is mostly fun for me. Um, I don't really care if people watch it or not, but. I mean, it's one of my favorite series of all time. I would like people to watch it, but I know it's unlikely because I barely get any clout with my more popular videos, um, which a lot of people like to air like normally, which are what if Naruto and what if Luffy. So yeah, I could do more what if Goku's as well. I should do that. I should continue my last one, which I haven't done for a while. It's been like a year. But anyways, so basically, um, this video is gonna be, what if Gon and Jamie, uh, what if Jamie raised Gon on the dark continent? So basically, we're just gonna age Jing up a little bit to where he, uh, to the age he is now, but he would be at the time of, um, uh, yeah, of the normal, uh, when he had gone, so gone because well, all of them would be the same age, but Jing would be a little bit yeah older than he normally is because yeah, because I don't think that Jing at a young age could even compete with anyone in the um dark continent because all of them are narrow. So we do know of one person from the street, uh, street, uh, street that has survived the dark, uh, dark continent and is most likely still alive, which is Dawn. So yeah, that will be interesting, but that will be later on. So we're going to say that he decided, uh, like people decided to send one of the top five strongest, which would be Jing, who is arguably stronger than Netro, uh, which I'm gonna put him above Netro for now because we need him to survive. I'm gonna make him above post Nero, uh, post death Nero as well. Um, I'm just gonna make him stronger than everyone we've seen so far because, yeah, otherwise they're kind of dead. Um, and so we're just gonna say he's an S class level threat. So he should be able to compete with anyone. But, so, he would take, he would be, he would have gone as an infant. Um, and he would think about taking him along, but instead he would leave him with one of his trusted friends. But instead, um, gone was able to slip into one of his bags or whatever, because why the hell not? So they arrive on the dark continent. Jean went to the east because that's where the first book, which Don Freak Rick was, it wrote him or whatever, was about. Like, that was the whole thing about Don's first book was the east part of that shit. So, yeah. Um, so. Right when they arrive, the boat is destroyed. So, they would have no way of getting back, and I'm going to say this for 12 years. Um, so, Jean would be raising Gon. It would be very hard to raise Gon, because we need food, all that shit. So, yeah, it would be a rough childhood for Gon. But, Gon would be far stronger. Because, one, he would have to be trained by Jing again because he needs to at least be able to survive a little bit or at least live until Jing can get there and kill whatever is around. On the time that they are there, they would uh, uh, Jing would get far stronger. He would definitely come back most definitely far above anyone, but of course he's lazy, so yeah. But anyways, so, Gon would not be a S 
level, A level, or B level. Um, he would be closer to C level. Oh, uh, where you kind of, because Merum is put at a B class, right? Um, so Gon would be like one level below. Um, so yeah. Um, they, uh, Gene, is, from what we heard, uh, have right now, is looking for Dawn. Because he believes Dawn is alive. And for this story's sake, he is. Because why the fuck not, you know? Why as well have a little bit of fun. So, when the boat arrives, um, you know, when the boat finally arrives, they would know where it is because, let's just say, they were able to get a messenger there, but they died right before they could get the message, but they found the message, so yeah. Um, which, there's clearly sea animals in that picture of the dark continent, so how the, why the fuck haven't they gone to the, um, main, uh, to our land, like, come on, like, anyways, but plot, so, yeah. We truly don't know how strong Gene is in the story. I, I will, oh, yeah, for now I'm putting him up in canon above, um, freaking, any, uh, like, Neko and them. Sorry, I got surprised by something, so I jumped a little bit. Um, but yeah. So, yeah, now he's definitely stronger than anyone in the story that we know so far. Of course, I'm going to put Dawn above him because Dawn has been in there for hundreds of years. Um, but Jean would decide to stay. He would tell Gon, who would be 12, to become a hunter. And once he's strong, and once he thinks he's strong enough to come back here and come help him out. Um, if he hasn't come back yet. So, Gon would, and, and since Gene, Gene was actually a good father, um, and this one raising him properly, and, well, at least to the best of his ability, um, uh, because this is all kind of Gon's fault, because the siblings were bad. Yeah, I know I could have made it to that Gene system, but I mean, you know, plot-wise. Um, but yeah. Kilo right now is freaking far below gone because he's probably only C level, if not lower. Um, don't get me wrong, he's strong. Kilo is very strong, but he doesn't even know Nen yet. But yeah, so he would not, uh, he would clearly not know Aunt Rico. The only parent he would ever know would be Eugene. Um, we are gonna leave Jean at the Dark Continent for a while. Let's just focus on Gone for a little bit, you know? Um. But there was a shadow looking over and it gone as he left. Pretty clear who it is. But yeah. Anyways. Um. So right when he gets back there would be a bunch of people one asking where Jean is and two asking all about what happened. Since Gon was practically raised there, he would be like, why are there even so peaceful? And where are all the animals and monsters and stuff? But he'd be like, eh, that did tell me that uh, this place was more peaceful. Oh, yada yada. So yeah. Um, he would freaking, because clearly Jean would teach him then, and probably Ren. Which I'm pretty sure it's like the bloodless, I think. It's been a while, but I'm pretty sure it's the red, uh, the bloodless thing. Um, so he would release a burst of Ren. Um, everyone would be shocked. There would be a couple, like, people like, I think that Necro would definitely be there. Because Necro's been to the Dark Continent, so anything related to the Dark Continent, he would want he would be there for. Um, so he would just be like, calm down. Um, so yeah. So, 
they he would all tell them um what his life was like, all that he knows. Because he doesn't know as much as Dean, because Dean, as he, like, went out more and more into his dark continent than Ungon did, he gets he left, like, near the shores of the dark continent, but a little bit further. Um, so, yeah. Um, he would t- uh, tell everyone about this, but yada, yada, um, and everyone would be shocked and then he would tell them that Dean survived they were expecting him to because he's the strong uh, he's the strongest they got um and yeah so Neto would be surprised that this little kid was able to survive but he does because it's implied that he put Dean above him um so he'd be like, eh, he was just mean, he was son, yada yada. Um, he'd be able to assess the gong sca- uh, skill. And, um, this is right around the time where the hunter exam starts, so he would ask about the hunter exam, yada yada. Um, he'd go to the hunter exam, he'd meet Leorio or Kirapita. Um, they w- Leorio and Kirapita wouldn't even fight at this point. And, and because Gon would just stop it in general. And once they get there, everything goes the same. They meet the same people. Yeah, yeah. Um, they finally get to the, um, what do they call it? The, the, fi- uh, the first exams. I guess that's true. The, the first exams. But basically... Um, Hisoka would notice Gon, and he'd be like, that's the kid that survived the dark, uh, dark continent. Which, I'm almost positive, Hisoka would definitely want to go to the dark continent. Just for shits and giggles. Um, of course, he'd most likely die there, but... It po- uh, post-death. And then, yeah, he would get bruised and maybe around that level. But anyways, so... Um, of course, there will be one new, um, creature from the Dark Continent that arrives. I'm just gonna leave that be because we don't know much. Once more information is out, I'll put a certain one in, yeah. Um, but yeah. So, he'd meet Kirua, and then, um, Kirua might know about Gone, but... He wouldn't really know. Gon would have a similar outfit to Dean when we first see him, like where he's wearing a cloak, yeah, and that kind of stuff, because the Dark Continent probably has very harsh conditions. Um. So yeah, we then uh, Gon would blitz pl- uh, past to. Uh, and be right up there with Hisoka, but I'm pretty sure if this was weird because Hisoka didn't get first. Maybe should have, but I guess he was just normally like jogging or whatever, having a little bit of fun, staying behind. So yeah, um, but let's just say Hisoka is going like a little uh, the fast, um. Hisoka's probably, maybe, because I put, uh, Marin, like, uh, a top B class, but, like, Hisoka's bottom B. Not bottom bitch, but bottom B class. The threat. Um, but yeah, Hisoka would still be stronger than Gon, because Gon's only, like, mid C class, um, threat level, because this is the, the one I'm using for the rankings. Um, Kilo is going to be like mid to high D class. But yeah. So, Hisoka would be uh, yeah, like surprised at the speed of this kid. And would definitely still see all the potential that Gon has. So yeah. Then we would have uh, everything else 
cover basically the same except the arm makes it through very easily. <laughs> then when we get to the tower thing, like the prisoners would not be an issue for Gon like at all. Most things would stay the same. Um but he wouldn't have the Oreo. Like he would make sure that his Oreo did not quit or anything or like blew up. So yeah. And they would just make it to the uh, marina after like Hanzo, so they would be fourth place. But yeah, that's where I'm gonna put it off because this is the first part. Don't want it too long. Um, but yeah, uh, Dean has just been um, continuously killing the animals that attack him, uh, and. Uh, Maybe start having traces of Don's uh, Don Friedkin's footsteps or whatever. But yeah, that's it. See you losers later.